He want to interview me. I'm not coming to interview over there with you, A.R.B. I don't have no reason to. You what we do, right? Why would I do that? It doesn't make sense. I'm talking to him. I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to him. Like how all y'all niggas have tried to huddle up and shit. I'm talking to that soft-ass nigga. I'm not talking to y'all, man. I've never talked to y'all about this, right? I'm talking to that soft-ass nigga. So when somebody jumps in this, they just want to have an excuse to say what they really feel, which doesn't make any sense because I'm talking to that soft-ass nigga. I, I entertain what y'all feel at another time. That nigga, though, right there. I'm, I'm talking to that one, though. I'm talking to the one that I know, not the one, not the one that y'all like think y'all know. I'm talking to that nigga right there. That one, the erratic one. I'm not talking to you, man. Everybody wants to jump in and go at Verb for talking to him. He don't speak well, right? He can't handle a bitch ass thing. And that footage is moving around. I'm about to y'all ain't notice I control this bitch ass nigga. Whenever I want him to jump, he gonna jump. Whenever I want him to stop what he's doing, he's gonna focus on me. You ain't I'm the only nigga he ever did that to. Cause I'm the only nigga that can control this bitch ass. He don't even, he can't even see the play. He can't even see the people are leading. Try, everybody wants to come around and say, I want to be against this. Ain't none of y'all move nothing. It been 30 of y'all. 30 of y'all have jumped. Holla had ARP and Beasley both go with him. Like that's never been done. Guys, and nothing has changed, has it? No, man. It hasn't. He just soft. All this shit could stop if he put his hands in them gloves and we see what's up. He don't want to do that. That's why it's going to keep going. Like, look, y'all, for real. Holla has about 30-some days, a little over that, before his next battle. I'm willing to step on him every single fucking day until that day of that battle. The day of that battle, he his his credibility and character will be so low, Geechee's going to go viral on him in a different type of way, too, though. Y'all saw me step on that white boy all last summer. I'm going to do it to him. This the hardest nigga in the gym to y'all? I think he's a bitch. Because he won't put his hands in them gloves, but he punched them other punks. He told y'all on that on that interview. He was on FaceTime with Cinnamon. He saw her grab her gun. He saw her grab the dog. He saw her go in the closet. He calmly said, what's going on? She said, it's some people here. And this bitch ass nigga called his boy around the corner. And y'all believe that. He didn't call the police. He called his boy like he was Batman or something. What was he supposed to do? Get in the bat jet, come over there and catch some crime fighters. So your girl is trapped in the house and you called your partner and talked to him for another 35, 45 seconds, a minute and a half of time meanwhile they in the house so then he got to get up out the bed he got to put on something get his keys then drive around there we talking about a five minute gap nigga we talking about a five minute gap from anywhere nigga picture this conversation y'all this is what i'm saying with this nigga that y'all ain't noticed i got him out of his body he gonna do spaces he gotta do everything because he can't let y'all find out the light is here bitch nigga it's too late you're done you're done can't no look, man. I'm not talking to another nigga about this nigga. I'm talking to that nigga. I'm not talking to none of you niggas. I'm talking to that nigga right there. Is that a problem? How many of y'all tried to defend him and ain't nothing happened, right? I'm talking to that nigga right there. So I'm not entertaining no arguments with none of y'all. I don't have no arguments with y'all. Y'all want him with me to protect him? It ain't gonna stop it. I'm on him, man. So you mean to tell me your girl in the house with intruders and you call your friend? And in the middle of the night, he's just waiting on you to answer. He ain't got no bitch. So in the middle of the night, you just called your friend. Did you click over and call a nigga? Or did you call him from your other phone? You didn't specify that either. So that means you had to, when she told you somebody was in the house, you had to pull out another phone. You didn't think to call the police. You called Batman around the corner. Batman on a Saturday night was laying in the house waiting on your phone to ring like you was fucking Commissioner Gordon. Then he put on his bat suit and drove around the corner to come save her. That's five minutes of time down, man. That's five minutes of time down on any street, nigga. Break that down on any street. That's five minutes of time down. From If you look at y'all right now, at the top of your street, and if a house at the bottom of the street, if that same scenario happened, it's still a five-minute mission. You called your boy. You didn't call the police.
but you cooperated when they got there, bro. All this shit documented. Ain't nobody making this shit up. This is what you said. You told us bullet went in her face, came out the back of her head. Then you changed the story, and then today you said she was shot point blank range. But then before that, it was she was shot through the closet. Nigga, do you remember the script? That's why he can't. Lil dude is under pressure. Have y'all ever seen him act like this before? No, because I'm telling the truth. He can throw whatever he want. He can speak whenever the fuck he want to speak and all y'all can listen. You will not beat this truth. You have too many lies on you. You have too many lies on you and too much aggression for me. And you ain't got this aggression for the niggas that shot him. You didn't cry one time on that on that camera, you bitch ass nigga. That's what I'm saying. You didn't cry one time for her. You can't try to put the, put her in front and say, oh, he's talking about sentiment. I brought up sentiment when you brought up my mama, you bitch ass nigga. When you said, because see, when your mama was sick, everybody held your bitch ass hand and gave you money, right? I didn't do all that, right? My mama's sick the same way. And that nigga said, my mama didn't love me. That's the reason why I don't like black women. That's what he said. Okay, well, let's play ball. So let's tell the truth about sentiment. He don't even remember that, though. He's so slow, he'll tell himself he's the victim. This is a slow, dumbass, basketball-playing-ass nigga. This is all the fuck he is. He's a dummy. Can't think. Erratic. Liar. Look how many lies he's caught in. What does he discuss with y'all? Money. There is no nigga on the planet with money that throw money around more than holler. There is no nigga on this planet with money that says they have money like holler does. So I guess Holler got a different type of money than everybody else who's rich. Where he just barks, I'm rich, I got money. I got, that's what he tell y'all. But you in scandals. You got a $60,000, you and PB got that thing talking about $60,000 and PB said that he didn't do that. You a gambler, the shit on your brother, the shit on your sister, y'all getting sued in the courts with bills. How in the fuck is you rich? What you are is a liar. That's what you are is a liar. Like 100% a liar. And I'm on your ass, Mr. Postman. So ARP, no, I don't have any words to say to you. Why? I'm not going to argue with you for that nigga. I'm talking to that nigga. Hey, ARP, that's how we do it in St. Louis. You're outnumbered with this. You you, you, you probably don't want to do that. We, we St. Louis niggas. I'm talking to that nigga. The nigga that I know more than you. I'm not even talking to you. I'm talking to him. Anybody else got a problem with that? I am talking to that nigga. That is the only nigga I'm talking to. Does anybody have a problem with it? I'm not here to pass no more messages with niggas. Y'all brought up 30, 40 niggas to speak against me, league owners, bloggers. I'm not talking to y'all. I'm talking to that nigga. Is that more than respected? I brought him. I know him. Y'all don't. So you can't defend him for me. And he talking about some, I bet you won't do that ARP interview. I don't have to do no fucking ARP interview. You still talking about rap, you little dork. We're not talking about rap anymore. We're in the real world now. I'm not talking to him. I'm not talking to ARP. You talk to ARP when it's pertaining to rap and arguing about rap. I'm not going to talk to your newfound friend about you. Fuck you. I'm talking to you. I'm not talking to him. You've been trying to always want somebody to come in and listen and help you speak. I'm talking to you, doofus. I'm not talking to that nigga. I met him through rap. Nigga, what you talking about? I know you. I'm not talking to him. You still think we playing rap. You're done, man. You are 100% done. You, you are 100% done. I promise you, you done. All that fake ass shit, you, this persona you done put on all this time, man. Shit, not fucking with Verb. I'm big, bro. You ain't playing with me, man. Uh-uh. The city's standing against you right now. Everybody talking about how dumb you look and the lies that you've told. Everybody thinking about that, Holly. I don't, I don't got to talk. I'm not talking to ARP, man. I'm talking to you. You talking about go do an ARP interview. I'm not doing no interview. Or for, what For fucking what? I'm not booked. I'm not rapping. I'm talking to you, though. I'm not booked. I'm not rapping. I'm talking to you. What kind of man keep getting in the middle of other niggas' shit? What the fuck kind of niggas is y'all? I'm talking to you, man. Just you. He can't do nothing by himself. I bet he won't do that ARP interview. I'm not doing nothing rap. I'm not talking. To, I'm you, nigga. I'm telling the truth on you. The fuck is you talking about? I'm talking to you, man. We got a long night, nigga. I, I hope you ready. Because I'm, I'm ready to go the next month on your ass. I didn't go on my playbook. This whole first round of these war, 
I just used your words. Now I'm going to use mine and my resources. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. I told you I got you, you little stupid nigga. You can keep thinking I don't. You talking about do an ARP interview, man. I'm not talking to him. I'm talking to you. ARP, I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to him. I have no words for ARP. ARP can go have his words for me. Tell how you feel. I don't care about that. I'm talking to him, though. My energy is for that nigga right there in the middle, in the red hat, turn to the back. Nobody else. Anybody else that get in the middle of that, you just want to have your energy in the pile with him. I'm still getting him, though. That's more than fair. Let's play the game, man. I'm not even talking to y'all, man. I know this nigga. Y'all don't. Everybody has tried to get in the middle and stand in front of some shit. What? This nigga has put all y'all in front of him and wouldn't put his hands in no gloves. Hey, Nick Cannon, we got 100000 that if he take a five-round boxing match with me, I stop that bitch-ass nigga to where he can't continue. You can't say, hey, hey, holla, you, you're going to have to fight me anywhere you go. And the world going to have to watch it. Because you're going to look real soft, nigga, because I got you boxed in. First, first, the first rule of war with me is I disarm you, nigga. I'm going to disarm you this week. You're going to have to take that fight. You're going to have to be a man, though. You're going to have to fight alone. You've been having count. Everybody knows you've had countless niggas speak because you can't speak. You were screaming and yelling in the camera last night, but you didn't have that aggression or energy for the niggas that shot your bitch. No, you did not. You have not put no bass in your voice or got aggressive with Gotti. You know, I know the truth. And that's where your anger come from. You, When you hear my name or you hear Smack name, look at how your face and your eyes change. Because we know the real shit with you. We the ones that make you feel uncomfortable. I do. I know I do. Because your whole face turns up. It's like an evil that come over you. You better tuck that bitch ass demon in, nigga. God got me. He don't got you. I'm so everybody here. I'm not talking to anybody. I'm not doing any outside interviews. Hitman Holla is my only target. I'm not doing a press run with anything pertaining to rap. That is my guy. I know if I come around and get excited, you get some views, you get some content. I am not responding to anything outside of this nigga. There will be no distractions on taking you down. Just you, dummy. Well, let me talk to it and let me let me uh, let me put it in basketball nigga terms. Uh, you're on the island with me. No help. This is me when me in the gym saying, "Hey, bum ass niggas, no help. No help." Iso, what's up? No help. Iso, don't you know when you hear that? Iso, you say, "No help, man." Hey, quit helping that nigga. If he got the, if Iso got the ball at the top and niggas trying to double him. And we in a wreck jam situation. He, man, quit helping this bitch ass nigga, man. Move. Slap the floor then. Lock up then, nigga. That's where we at with it. Right here. That's all I need. None of you niggas matter. We, we know the story. We've heard it through all the bloggers. We've heard it through all the motherfucking um, rappers that wanted to stand up. We heard the stories. None of them did nothing. League owners. I had two league owners going to spaces with him. And ain't nothing changed. And I'm still here barking. I'm getting him. I'm not fucking with y'all. Y'all don't matter to me right now. I do not rap. That's why your platforms don't matter to me because I do not rap. I'm talking to him, though. I have not asked to come on anybody's platform to speak. I've been talking on my own. Yes, I've been speaking on my own until two weeks ago I brought Byron in. I've been speaking on my own, talking on my own, not doing niggas' platform. I ain't did none of that type of shit. Where do y'all see it? I've kept it. Straight up and down on my side of the street. Who did the fake shit? You brought in, he had niggas speaking on me from out of town that I don't even know. Just trying to make it feel good. You're fighting alone, man. I'm not talking to him. I'm talking to you. Man. Let ARP talk to whoever he want to talk to, say what he want to say on his own time, but I got no response. You, though, nigga, I'm going to break you. Because I know breaking you is going to hurt him, though. So whatever he want to say, he can just say. But I'm going to break you, though. Because he, he think rap-wise with you. I'm breaking you in the real world in front of our people. Because, see, you can't trick us. You can trick these niggas. He won't trick us, though. And I'm going to score. You know it. See, you, you don't tell people the truth about you at all, man. But don't worry about it. Everybody going to look crazy who defending you. But just keep in mind, y'all. Everybody that's trying to defend a nigga, 
make sure you write their names down. Write their names down because we don't want no switching. No switching. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. It's me and you. Head up. Uh-uh. Quit helping that nigga. Who's the guy looking for help? If we was talking, hey, Holly, let me put it in basketball time. Um, during this whole war that we've been having, you've been running behind screens, man. You've been running behind all the screens. You've been calling for a pick everywhere on this court. Help me. Get here. And I'm just getting through the pick and steady standing in front of you, slapping the floor. Okay. Now, ISO, me and you. It's me and you, Holly, right here. I'm slapping the floor on defense. You done ran behind 30 screens, and, and, and you're not winning the game. And I'm getting through each screen, Holla. I'm talking your, your language, who you really should be. I'm getting through each screen. You know that's hard to do when you play basketball. Somebody's getting through constant screens. He's getting through them. That means he'll lock you the fuck up. But will lock you the fuck up, man. That's it. I didn't, I didn't invite y'all niggas to a barbecue. This ain't no hangout. Y'all his friends be his friends. You just met him. But I'm not talking to y'all. I'm not talking to y'all. And he couldn't stop anything if it went wrong for y'all. No, he cannot. You think he can. No, the fuck he cannot. I'm talking to you. We want to know that. We want to know how you rich niggas, how, how did, this nigga said he got sold an alarm system where the, where the windows only go off from the inside. Okay, well, you're the dummy, bitch. That don't fucking make sense. Okay, so if somebody busted your windows, to break in your house, did they bust the entire window and walk straight through? Or did they bust a piece of the window and reach in and lift the window up? Because if they lifted the window up, the alarm should still go off. And you said you were suing the alarm company and you didn't cry. And you haven't pursued suing the alarm company. Yeah, look, man, I keep telling y'all, man, dude is about to fail fucking with me, man. He's going to fail. Y'all keep trying to get in the middle of something and you're going to look dumb in the end, man. Because it won't be, hey, holla, once the world knows that you lied and took them people's money and shit like that, you're done, man. And that's just one of my moves that's going to happen in the next month. I'm way too smart, way too calculated. Some people just want to, like, debate or challenge me because it's they high. I want to challenge him because he's so smart. I'm not even talking to you, man. I'm talking to dude, man. And that's the only person I'm talking to is him. Everybody has tried to hold hands and say, I'm with him. Oh, holla. I'm, no, I'm with you, holla. Y'all not with a bitch-ass thing, man, because I got him. That's it. I got dude, man. Ain't nothing going to change. Y'all keep thinking this is rap. It has nothing to do with that, man. It's principle, a whole bunch of other shit. Man. I'm not even talking to y'all no more, man. Right. You. But holla, guess what? Oh, yeah, like I was telling you about that disarming thing. See, holla, you're so not smart. I can give you the playbook ahead of time, and you still gonna fuck it up. I'm gonna disarm you though. We going first thing we are gonna do is take all that gangster shit from you. You know how you people think you so hard. We gonna pull that shit right up under you, right quick. Hey, everybody around him, watch how I strip this nigga. Watch how I make this nigga look like nothing, cause I'm the only nigga that did it to him on stage, and I had to make that rhyme. I don't gotta make this rhyme, man. Motherfucking. I got a space at 12. Sure. Everybody go enjoy. It's not a big thing, Holla. You're going to fail, bro. You're going to 100% fail. You cannot trick these humans, man. They, they'll play with you for a second. But one thing about niggas, Holla, when they get too hot, they jump out their car, bro. They jump out the car. And I'm equipped with so much bad shit to do to you. Dude, the shit that I'm going to do to you, Holla, I got so much, I don't even know where to go, bro. For real. See, like when you when you got a nigga mouth, and look, I know this gonna trigger some niggas. It is gonna trigger some niggas though. But I'm not talking to y'all. So that if I'm not talking to you, right, and my words is triggering you, right? If I'm not talking to you and my words is triggering you, that means you got an inner hate for me. I'm not even talking to you. So let that mar marinate through your mind. If I'm not talking to you. And you're you're getting triggered and you're angry by the things I'm saying about another nigga. You have a feeling toward me. It does make sense. It does. But guess what, guys? All is well. Enjoy the show. But that duck is on the fucking grill, regardless of what y'all think. 
this has been planned and I'm going to strip this nigga of everything before he open his mouth on the day he battles. He will never be the same.